Police violence is not new, but it's finally gone viral. We're living in a time when viral videos of police violence run rampant on social media. When attention grabbing headlines continue to make the case for much needed structural transformation of police departments across the entire country. When citizens of this country can't seem to go a day without witnessing yet another instance of cops abusing their power and leaving many feeling like they're not being served or protected by the institutions we were told would do so. It is within this climate that local Arizona station ABC 15 brings us their investigative special, Full Disclosure. The report digs into Arizona's Brady List, a database system designed to track police officers with histories of lying and committing crimes. During a year-long investigation, the team at ABC 15 combs through endless files on cops who got bounced from department to department, showing how it affected cases all over the state. This is an eye-opening series, and it's rooted in fact, in paperwork, in body cams, and in undeniable and painstakingly retrieved evidence. And the portrait it paints is as unsavory as it is necessary for showcasing the best of what local journalism can do. Full Disclosure wins a Peabody Award. Tonight, a special ABC 15 investigation. What happens when police officers lie, make up evidence, make bad arrests? When you have an officer who's willing to lie, the entire system breaks down. But what if the system is already broken? Prosecuting people isn't a game. Putting people in prison is not a game. That's why we have Brady. We've spent a year investigating problems with Arizona's Brady lists, the lists prosecutors use to track lying and criminal cops. We found the lists are missing officers. <laughs> the process missing basic accountability. And as a result, juries are missing the truth. The public has to A, hope that the police department investigates it, that the police department sustains it, that they then turn it over to the county attorney's office, and then that the county attorney's office turns it over to attorneys like you. That seems like a lot of steps that we have to trust them without having anyone else in place to oversee that they actually do it. That's absolutely right, and that's the problem. Hi, I'm Dave Biscobing, investigative reporter at ABC 15 Arizona. And from our entire team, we are thrilled and deeply honored to have our story included with all of the others this year. Full Disclosure is a story true to its name. For 60 years, police and prosecutors have been required, constitutionally required, to turn over negative information about officers involved in criminal cases. See, the court, judge, jury, they deserve and need to know whether officers are documented liars or have criminal records themselves. But for 60 years, police and prosecutors have failed. And this is not just some academic issue. These failures ruin lives. They corrupt trials, send innocent people to jail, and leave dangerous officers on the street. That's why Full Disclosure was a story we had to tell. And it's not just a story, it's a public resource. A place where anyone, anywhere, at any time, can find Arizona officers with documented lies and crimes. Now this story is fixing the problems. Problems our criminal justice system is too ignorant, arrogant, and indifferent to fix themselves. Now the theme here tonight is stories that matter. And in local news, what we do does matter. Again, we're deeply honored and thankful that the Peabody Awards recognize our work and for decades have recognized the work of journalists across the country. In news, our goal really is simple. Tell stories that matter. Tell stories people need to hear. Thank you.